嘿、hey, ，大家好，这里是平常不宅电玩，欢迎再次和我一起回到 d e s x 呃，好吧，我们上一次呢，从那个唐思宏，中国黑帮老大那里得到了这个前来寻求庇护的那个骇客布鲁根，那他和我们透露，他藏在这里的一个酒店，叫做爱丽丝豆家园。其实就是胶囊酒店啦，所以我们现在就要进去找他，然后打清清楚事情的真相。OK， 哼哼 ，Hello， 好吧。你在讲手机，你在忙。我听说他们想把改变回原来那种，对那个感受到他坏脾气的人，人慈一点。那我们这些租房把我们都赶出去吗？他们不能这么做。他妈的，有些人已经在这住了很多年了。他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，他妈的，呃，看起来是不错啊。关东煮，呃，自由，也是礼品店，是不是？这个月又得捉襟见肘了。房租钱又不够了。嘘，你知道杰很爱偷听别人，我能感觉到他就在那躺着的。杰是谁啊？不好意思，哎，你找到工作了吗？没有。杰是房东吗？为什么进不去？因为那是窗户，是吗？如果是的话，还真是我见过最干净的窗户。<笑> Hello， 你们为什么都要武装？啊，很好，很好。Hello. Yes, yes. Beds on second and third floor. Showers and laundry in basement. You want a part? Uh, 没有，我来这里找人的。哼，来看一下三零一号房。那我们现在在最底层，所以我们要上去的是，不要介意。哦吼，对面有东西。嗯。一本书，龙头，二十一世纪的三合会，一种传统的形式。三合会中原始的八个职位等级结构制度，现在在现代已经被简化了。像侯门三十六式的传统仪式，已经逐渐淡出人们视线了。取而代之的是修辞更少、言简意赅的效忠承诺。现在的四级职位制度系统反映了三合会犯罪集团与时俱进，以及进呃还有及时进行自我调整的能力和弹性。其会内职位的名称来自于数字和传统禁运的组合。基层成员和考考察时期成员大部分来自于青少年犯罪集团。在所谓的。挂蓝灯笼入会仪式结束之后，他们便成为了代号49的普通成员。他们的上级是集团中管理层和执行官，代号分别为白纸扇、四五、红棍、四二六和草鞋四三二。位于金字塔顶尖的指挥成员则叫做二路元帅、副座官、副副座管和乡主。代号都为四三八，而最终带头大哥只有一名，通常被称作为做官做官
，也或是龙头四八九，好吧，蛮特别的。这件事我完全不知道，长知识了，真的。我的日记周建，我对这个地方感到厌倦，一天有一天，一天有一天都是如此。为一群失败的家伙解决问题，鼓励鼓励我吧，别让我没话说。那么多蠢货，我从工程学院毕业就是来搞这个的吗？我要离开这里了，这个破旅店太让我失望。我现在就要赚钱，然后离开这里，再也不回来。再过两年就这样，那我就要离开了。我要离开恒沙，去享受美好的日照和新鲜空气，还得去修凳的前门。这是两周来第三次了，他老是喝醉回家，找不到钥匙就踢门。这个地方快把我逼疯了，我迫不及待想离开。那个人在这里，<笑>不应该偷看他的日记了，以免惹他生气。好吧，三零号房。Jensen, I, I was on my way out. What are you doing here, Malik? I told you I got this one. I know. I, I didn't do anything. Trust me, Van Bruggen's all yours. Hang on a second. Something's wrong. What is it? Why are you here? It's nothing. I mean, can't a girl have secrets? Of course, but I can tell something's bothering you. And I'm concerned. What's going on? I just, I just had to look into something for a friend. She, she deserved better. I'm listening. Fine. Since you're so damn curious, years ago I used to live here. Remember, my friend, my best friend, Evelyn. She was like a sister to me. Made living here fun. But then there was an accident. She, she's dead. I'm sorry, Malik. Wait, Jensen. Let me finish. I thought I was okay with it, but. I know, I know she didn't just die. She was killed, murdered. Her damn scumbag boyfriend did it. I know he did. I knew he was trouble right from the start, but she just wouldn't listen to me. Malik, easy. If your friend was murdered, the police would have suspected something. They would have investigated. That's just it. There was no investigation. They said she fell down a flight of stairs like it was some kind of freak accident. But her wounds, the way she died, they don't add up. It's right here in the damn blood spatter analysis. Blood spatter? You've seen the police report? Yes. A friend left a copy of it in a pod here for me to pick up. Listen, I know it sounds crazy, but I think, I think there's been a cover-up. I just have to prove it. If I could get my hands on the autopsy report, the one that never surfaced, I know I'd get the truth. Except. Why do I suspect I'm about to get dragged into something? Look, Jensen. I'm sorry. I know Van Bruggen is the priority here, and I told you it was my business, and I could take care of it. It's just, the more I think about it, the more I realize I'm in over my head. I'm just a pilot. I'm not a damn cop. But I need to know the truth. Oh, okay. Yeah. I need some energy. Don't do that. He's our friend. 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 This autopsy report. Once you got your hands on it, what were you planning on doing next? I, I'm not sure. Like I said, I'm a pilot, not a cop. But I just, I felt I had to do something while I had the chance. Maybe once you get the report and we know what it says, we can improvise. <laughs> Tell me about Evelyn. She was beautiful, carefree, loved to have a good time. I met her during my internship for a private transportation and logistics firm here in Shanghai. She was a great pilot too. knew how to feel the currents, to push the bird just so. Too bad her talents for reading the wind didn't translate to reading guys. <laughs> so. She was always getting into trouble with the wrong crowds, and it always had to do with some boy. She knew I didn't like him. Her boyfriend at the time, Lee. It drove a wedge between us, and when we parted ways, it wasn't amicable. I understand. She was a good girl, Jensen. She deserved better. 还有女孩总是喜欢坏男人就是了。Why do you suspect Evelyn's boyfriend had something to do with her death? Because he was poison right from the start, born into money and influence, but never once assuming responsibility for anything. I don't think he's worked an honest day in his life. 
So he was a wealthy, big-headed asshole. If that was reason enough to accuse someone of murder, half the world would be in the pen. <laughs> no, there's more to it than that. He's known for violent outbursts, domestic altercations. He nearly killed a kid over some stupid gambling feud. The problem is, his family made him untouchable, even to the police. And Evelyn was okay with all of this? She... always tried to see the good in people, give him the benefit of the doubt. <sighs> You could say that's just being naive or even stupid, but I think she was just innocent. You said you've seen the police report. Who gave it to you? An old friend who was also a good friend of Evelyn's. He used to work for the Shanghai PD. He left a copy of it along with a few other things concerning Evelyn in a pod here for me to look at. He also left some instructions on how to contact someone at Lim for the autopsy report he's convinced was intentionally buried. Why would Lim have anything to do with Evelyn's autopsy report? Well, if you haven't noticed, the Chinese government has been outsourcing branches of its public services for years. Bell Tower polices the streets, and nowadays Lim does more than just cosmetic surgery. They're often contracted for special cases like Evelyn's. And what made Evelyn's case so special, you think? Her boyfriend, Lee. He was at the scene. He had Evelyn's blood on him and tested positive for alcohol and drugs in his system. With his rap sheet, it wasn't looking good for him. But his family, they're on a lot of boards with deep pockets and a lot of reach. They must suffer the embarrassment of having their son indicted on a suspected murder charge. Okay, I'll help you. Then Merrick, you give me a good place to stay in the plane. I don't want you to get hurt, you know. 毕竟我也算蛮喜欢你的。Okay, I'll help. What do you need me to do? My lead. He works for Lim. He's a systems technician who apparently has access to their entire database. He's willing to hand over a copy of Evelyn's autopsy report. So you want me to meet him and get the report? Is that it? Yes, but he'll only respond to a certain phrase. Death and life have their determined appointments. <laughs> to which he'll reply, riches and honors depend upon heaven. Christ, Malik, this is starting to sound like something out of a bad spy movie. I know. He's just trying to protect himself. I didn't pick the damn quote. So just play along and remember the line, okay? You'll find him inside the lobby of the Lower Hengshaw Lim Clinic. Does this guy have a name? None that I know of. But he apparently <laughs> goes by the handle Anonymous X. I know, I know. Anonymous X. Okay. Anything else? Yeah. Before I forget, everything concerning Evelyn's incident. Newspaper articles, the police report, limb details—it's all inside pod zero zero nine here in the hotel. You should read over everything you can. Pod nine, got it. I need to go. Contact me with any updates and thank you. I really appreciate this, Jensen. Okay, the. 只要你安全就好。嗯，好吧，来看一下我们的新任务。九号舱。嗯，那重点是旅馆在哪里？嗯 ，Hello。对，我在找东西。Earth Seeker's fear is in serious trouble, Eliza, and it's time that we as a species stepped up to make things better. OK， 这里有楼梯。首先呢，那个在三零一，骇客在三零一，那我们先去什么九号？九号仓库找东西。好吧，这就是所谓胶胶囊旅馆。这种东西在中国真的存在吗？一个人住在这么小小一间房间。实在接受不了和你在那种地方睡觉，但是那是我的家呀，没别的意思。不过你的家实在太脏了，哪差啊？这房子就跟沙丁鱼罐头一边大，连屋里的味道都很像。我本来想说，要不咱们去旅馆吧，可是这就是个旅馆。<笑>天哪，不会吧？我会帮你消除烦恼。呃，真的蛮悲惨的，一个人的小小空间就……啊，天哪！我真不晓得，居然真的有人可以忍受，真的很悲惨。哦，通风口。哦 ，nice， 这里有。
，这种电子重力技术应用，修达罗工业，修达罗博士二零一五年八月向美国空军进行的一项技术展示。电子重力发生器源于俄罗斯一项不成熟的技术，致力研究提升人类军事领域的。子系统方面应用，尽管不能替代真正的重力在军事作战中的作用，例如绳索、速降和跳伞，但电子重力发生器的应用却是复杂繁多，取决于植入人体哪一个部位。核心单元重力模组和能源组成与被植入者的脊椎融合在一起，分散在真皮层的各个感应器和内耳的监测纤维与内置的加速。即协同工作，被植入者的身体正处于不受控制的掉落状态数秒钟，脉冲向胃膜会被激活。因此，经过训练的熟练操作员可以从超窄的超从可以从超过三十英尺甚至超过一百英尺的高度坠落而不受到任何伤害。现在为什么你知道我们在 R N D 称它为呵呵蹦蹦极神了？这这是这会不会就是我那个伊卡洛斯的那个降落系统啊？喂，好吧，呃，九号仓库，九号仓库这边有没有？哎，这边有，这边有号码 ，nice。嗯，在第二层住上层人应该蛮不方便的，他们要怎么爬上去啊？哦 ，nice。哦，这个没有看错。哎、欸，等一下，这就是我刚来的地方啊！算了，先看一下这个通往哪。为什么刚刚有一闪一闪的？你没有注意到吗？我靠！哈喽，你还真是处变不惊啊！一个人从通风口跳下来。你想买什么吗？随便看看吧。好吧，再上去一次。然后二十二号，好吧，离九号更加接近了。哎、欸，谁在推我？你在玩 PSP 吗？十号、九号到了。口袋秘书，警方报告。呃，女技师，志在之同意的今晚和你见面。我不知道这次机会是大是小，或者我们有多少把握，但是这是我们唯一要继续做下去的事。希望他能够让我们放心。这一团就他知道的最多。抱歉，在这世上我不能帮你什么。就像看到你行走，我很痛苦一样。我的手被绑住了。如果我的监督人发现我在谈论此事，他会吵了我的。案发当时我已经附上一份警察报告，存档附件，原件已经被已经被 ID 销毁了，你不会有机会看见的。验尸报告应该能弥补一些空白。你欠我一个保证，你我来看一下验尸报告：二十三岁白人女性坠下楼梯后，在送院中途死亡。案发现场，男友是唯一目击者，受害人伊芙琳，承受的伤害若干处头部外伤，颅盖骨撕裂，出内出血。
有可能是死因嫌犯立红。呃，细节据证言，在二十。在二十三点四九分 ，LHPF 的工作人员接到二零九号嫌犯立红的求救，到达现场后，目击五九四号受害人伊芙琳倒在附近的地上，受害人无反应。首个到达现场的内科急救专家小组宣布，受害人在凌晨在十二点零二分死亡，受害人被运送至。巴拉巴拉，进做一步做进一步评估和处理。嫌犯穿着一件覆盖受害人的血和衬衫，覆盖着受害人的血的衬衫，被现场的马基警官盘问。嫌犯显得很紧张，声称受害人在事发之前喝了很多酒。嫌犯接受了检查，确定有酒醉嫌疑。内科急救专家认为他无恙后，嫌疑犯被扣留。呃，嫌疑犯声称在事发后马上给 LHBF 求救，时间大约在1 1点四十分到1 1一点四十之间。进一步筛选和尿检验显示，嫌犯体内有麻醉成分。嫌犯一直被拘留到他释放之前。现场证据找到非确定性的证据，证明嫌犯的口供。学籍分析证明血溅出的样子符合坠楼。的样子，没有证据显示一个中低速率的冲击与受害人伤口吻合，并导致受害人死亡，头部的钝创和颅内出血。正在等待进一步证据出来，嫌犯免于起诉。这是起诉与否，看受害代理人的意见。呃，所以一直说这边没有证据显示。他要找到两个伤口，是不是？一个是符合坠楼，一个是找不到，找不到，就是还有一个伤口是找不到证据，就是头部内创、钝创。好吧，声声东击西，伊芙琳·卡迈尔，一个刚刚二十岁的年轻女子。据目击者声称，事件爆发的时候，伊芙琳正与男友逛街庆祝。一名身份未被公开的目击者宣称，他跌倒之后，呃，从数个台阶上滑下，直到下面的盘灯街。警察认为酒精或是药物引起是引起这事故的主要原因。但是有的官员表示，如果法律与现在不同的话，那这样的惨剧是完全可以避免的。由于选举就在附近的。街道拐角，伊芙琳的死去毫无疑问的将掀起一场充满争议、关于全市范围内安全法规的讨论。与天台有关伤亡情况，在过去五年间逐步上升，并且构成了每天记录的天灾事故的六十趴。好吧，我这是麻将，哈哈哈哈哈。啊！你们人满了，没有缺卡。在麻将中如何获胜？基本技巧：麻将并不是一种靠运气变的银牌游戏。叭叭叭，长胜军啊！好好好，对。好吧，然后我们要到三楼。哎，这里我们来过吗 ？Are you security? Make this man get rid of this disgusting rodent. I know what you have in there. I don't know what you're talking about. I saw you with ferret in your shirt the other day. You know pets are not allowed in hotel. That's not true. I tell Mr. Chow if you not get rid of it. You're a very mean lady. <laughs> 嗯，哦 ，nice， 这里有一个，到处都是钱。三楼，这里居然有把枪，告诉我。
嗯，啊、呃，不用说，第二句对你十分失望。我也是，我告诉过你，这是一个肮脏的工作。如果你连一个小女人都无法摆布，还能怎样奢望成一个，成为一个四二六呢？哦，等下，等下，等下，这是上个会的那个代码吗？我们之前不是看过吗？四二六红棍，上级集团中的管理层执行官。好吧，关于你交给我那个收集工作，我努力过了，真的，但是那婊子就是不同意条件。你知道我向来不接受否定答案，但你向你知道我向来不是接受否定答案的那种人，尤其对女人来说。但这女人却有所不同，我觉得她一定对我使用了强化装置。从而说服我远离他，<笑>好吧，所以这里是一个黑帮的住的地方，而且来头还不小。呃，三零一是吧？记得还可以住三零一。三零一，四零二的。天哪、啊，这里到处都是一堆东西啊！日记，有小孩砸了我的门，还嘲笑我。他喊我死灾难，和孤独的人对我又抓又踢，不知道他们是哪个女人的孩子。我对他们声音反击了。今天是个好日子，我通常坐在，我坐在通常坐的地方，看着窗外，人们看起来悲伤而失落。我不生气的时候很可怜他们。今天下午四点十八分，有人给我打了电话，我很惊讶，有人会给我打电话。我一直都在想，那是不是打错，还是出于什么目的？我不喜欢今天这样的日子，他们让我紧张困惑。今天我特别冷，非常冷，我给自己做了一碗热汤也无济于事。我有时候想，是不是我的血太稀薄了？昨晚我的邻居特别吵，他开特别大的声音放音乐，我想他是为了掩盖他和女朋友的某种声音。<笑>如果我是在这里常住的话，我一定要教他一些礼貌。我想他来自于中亚，事实上我有点喜欢他的音乐。<笑>好吧。呵呵，真是蛮有趣的。Hello。滚开，窝囊废。I just don't understand how a city can grow to a point where there can be so many. 好吧，我猜应该是这里了，三零一。三零一，能量包哦 ，Come on！ 啊、哦，天哪！我有太多武器，而且有一部分武器是我根本就不会用到的三零一到底在哪？哦、oh, ，Hello， 呃、uh, ，Hello。Forget it, man. You're not my type. This isn't a booty call, Van Bruggen. This is about you and some friends of yours I met in Detroit. Detroit. Yeah, okay. I got it now. 那你蛮聪明的嘛。You were there when I had to pull the plug. So you admit it. You were running the mall. The heck, man. Just the heck. Worst decision I ever made taking that gig, as you can obviously see. You attack my people, Windmill. You hope to walk away from this. You tell me what you know. Damn boy, I've got no allegiance to that backstabbing bitch who hired me, especially after she painted a target on my back. The girl you want is Zhao Yunru, Tai Yong Medical CEO. Tai Yong Medical? They're Sarah's biggest competition. How do you think they got that way? Zhao doesn't like competition, see? So she uses hack attacks, blackmail, extortion, anything she can do to destabilize it. No offense, but Saref was just the latest in a long line. You got any proof of this? There's a surveillance recording in the Tai Yong Tower. 
I stashed it on the server in case I ever needed an insurance policy. Not a very smart place to hide it, seeing as you don't work there anymore. Things got hot before I could move it. And now, I got you to get it for me. Of course, you can't just walk into that place. You're gonna need an employee card encoded with your biometrics to use the TYM shuttle. Let me guess. You're gonna tell me where to get one. Hey, I'm always prepared. There's a certain security guard likes to dabble with the ladies. <laughs> You'll find him at the Hong Hua Hotel top floor corner room. Sneak in, snatch the card while he's otherwise engaged and bring it back here so I can code it with the biometrics in your passport. I was there when you flatlined that Mo Van Bruggen. You think I'm gonna trust you? You have to if you want that evidence. Now run along, Sarif man. And don't get too distracted watching the action. Uh, how bad? So, it is. Um, he taught. 他的幕后幕后黑手是永泰医药公司，也就是 Serif 最大竞争对手。他的老板头儿是叫是一个叫赵云如的女士。那我现在为了搞到证据，我必须潜进去，所以我得先拿到员工 ID 证。那好吧，在红花酒店嫖妓。嗯。那另外一个任务就是和自在之联系。OK， 好吧，动作得快点，我们还有一堆事情要做。Come on，jump，jump jump。所以目前得到的消息是，指使那场恐怖攻击的有可能是永泰。医药公司咯，就是三个月前想摧毁，三个月前摧毁那个 Megan 研究的家伙。OK， 我们现在非常接近自在之绳索，所以先去那里拜访拜访。自在之诊所在这里，很好，累不？非常可悲。哦，他的穿着，哎，哎。Can't you see I'm busy? Go bother someone else. 对对对，说那句暗语。Death and life have their determined appointments. What? Oh, and riches and honors depend upon heaven. Very good. Right. What now? Shh. They have eyes and ears everywhere. Meet me outside the clinic. Turn left from the front and go down the stairs. I'll be waiting at the corner. 哈。他说他在转角处。Hello。Over here. Come on now. I'm relieved to know they sent a professional at least. That makes two of us. Right. Well, though not exactly what I was expecting. I was told I would be meeting a girl. How do I know you're not an imposter or some sort of double agent? 我已经说暗语了。Don't think I don't know. This could all just be an elaborate trap to set me up. Look, no offense, Mr. X or whatever your name is. But I really don't have time for this. So if you could simply just give me what I came for, I'll be on my way. Yes, yes, I have it right here. Evelyn Carmichael's autopsy report. Here, 
Take it. Thank you. I trust you will put this information to good use, because accountability and justice is at an all-time low, I'm afraid. It pains me to see this once great city, which stood as a bastion for reform and progress against our oppressive communist origins, succumb to the trappings of corporate bureaucracy and petty corruption. Corruption so often typical of your Western governments. Whatever you say. Now, if you don't mind, I really must be going. Well, there is still the matter of my payment. One thousand credits was the agreed upon price, I believe. Uh, this I didn't hear. Right? Right? Okay. And what were you just saying about corruption? A deal is a deal. Surely your handlers informed you of this little detail. No, my handlers failed to mention this little detail. Never mind. Just take your money. This report better be worth it. Oh, I assure you it is. Whoever it was that didn't want this information given to the proper authorities paid a lot of money to have it ignored. A pity for them, Lim policy strictly prohibits deletion of records concerning operational procedures. For legal purposes, you see. Legal, right. Nice doing business with you, X. Okay, okay. 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 Okay.